Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. How's it going? So today we have a, an EPI clutch kit for the T-Rex 4, but we're only going to be doing the secondary clutch today. As you all know, the T-Rex itself is a wonderful machine so far, and we've been working on it, right? So. We've got tires, we've got a lift, we've got everything. If you want to know how to do this job to get to the clutching, remember we have a how to change your belt video. It gives you torque specs and everything else. Right now I'm just cleaning my clutches with a little bit of acetone and a rag. And just look at the dirt. It's just beautiful. So, you're going to need a pressing tool. C clamps also. Pliers. C, uh, yeah, C clamp pliers. I have them somewhere here. And you're just going to want to compress your spring. That's a blooper. <laughs> Fuck. I'm just gonna want to tighten it down. Not too much, just enough so you can get your clamp out see right now I can get my C clamp out if you want to zoom in here No, they used to come in packs of four. Can't tire. We got new tools. Now I hope you were right about this one. What's that? But this is exactly what I need. Yeah, I hope so. And we are back with a fresh battery. Yep. Now why is this not working like it should? Loosen this. 
is here. It's here. Your snap ring. Don't lose it. You'll need it. Primary spring. And secondary spring. Now, that is the difference. So, the reason for this spring is to grab more torque at the end of the line. So, steps are simple. Put it back, tighten it down. Now this is supposed to help you with your belt slippage. Grab more torque, more power. But remember, we have a spring that will be a, a lot more compressed than the stock. Make sure you have these tools and don't do it with vice grips. Because I know some people will try it out. Because let me tell you guys, if you use vice grips on these springs and it decides to let go, you better be pretty fast at ducking because that spring will go flying. Now you do want to be careful with this as you can get hurt. Nobody's invincible. So just to clarify you guys, if you go with the IPI clutch performance, the white ring will be for your top speed to help get more top speed. You get what, five kilometers more an hour? Something like that while the pink one the one we're putting on is for torque so if you're in the mud most of the time drag racing this is the one you want on i don't think t-rexes should be drag racing but everybody has different opinions right am i right different opinions so if you have two t-rexes go and hit the head why not yeah but now everybody's on this need more power but I, I really can't wait to see that ridge though. So let me get your snap ring. Open it up. Slide it in. Make sure she clamps perfectly. Because if she don't, she's not going to stay there. Click and it's in. So now you got to. I'm double checking, making sure, making sure everything's good. And there you have it. Moment of truth, moment of truth. There we go. Secondary clutch spring done. If you have all the tools, this job should take you about five minutes once the clutches are out. And if you want the torque specs for the clutches and everything else, remember, we have a belt change video. Torque specs are in there. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And look at this beauty now. You think she's gonna slip? I hope not. We'll have to try it out. Remember to like, subscribe, leave a comment. Peace.